In this tutorial, we will show you how to create a drag and drop feature in Scratch. First, we need to select the sprite we want to be able to drag and drop. We see the costumes menu on the left hand side of the screen. Next, we need to select the costume we want to use for our sprite. You will see the code menu on the right hand side of the screen. Now, we can start coding. We see the code editor on the right hand side of the screen. First, we need to add code that will allow us to click on the sprite and drag it around. Insert code, when this sprite clicked. Forever if mouse down, point towards mouse pointer change X by mouse X, X. If touching sprite 1, hide. Next get, set drag mod. Let's test it. After, duplicate the ball. Delete the duplicated ball and get the block create clone of myself. Get when I start as a clone. Next get, go to a down position. Then, get a forever loop and wait for one second then create clone. First, let's create a sprite. Then, we will add a new sprite, which will be the timer itself. Next get, change my variable by minus one second and set it up to 300 seconds. After get, a forever loop and put it change, time by minus one. Get it when the green flag is clicked. Wait one second. Test it. Next get if then block, if time equals to zero. Then send a message to game over screen. If then time equals to zero then stop all. Test it. Add a new sprite to your project by selecting choose a sprite. From the sprite library or by uploading your own image. Design the game over screen by adding text, images or animations that convey the game being over. Add a broadcast block to your project. By clicking on the control category and selecting broadcast, drag the show block from the looks category and place it inside the when I receive block to show the game over sprite. When the game over message is received. Note, you must put a when the green flag is clicked high. Last step dot go back to the ball sprite. Create a new variable and call it score. Then drag it a change block by one and put it under if touching scratch cat or whatever your sprite is called. Then, the fun part design your game. We see the scratch project on the screen with the draggable sprite. And that's it, you now have a draggable sprite in scratch. If you liked this video, like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.